एग्जाम्पल टू पॉइंट टेन टू रजिस्टर्स ऑफ रेजिस्टेंस आर वन इक्वल टू हंड्रेड प्लस और माइनस थ्री ओम एंड आर टू इक्वल टू टू हंड्रेड प्लस और माइनस फोर ओम आर कनेक्टेड रेजिस्टेंस ऑफ द ए सीरीज कॉम्बिनेशन बी पैरल कॉम्बिनेशन यूज फॉर ए द रिलेशन आर इक्वल टू आर वन प्लस आर टू and for b 1 upon r dash that is equal to 1 upon r1 plus 1 upon r2 and another relation that is delta r dash upon r dash square equal to delta r1 upon r1 square plus delta r2 upon r2 square now here the values of resistances r1 and r2 are given to you and in series and parallel combination which equations you have to use are also given to you right here no need to think about the derivation of this equation a equation kya thi aavya any apne chinta karvani nahi right these equations are given to you and as per this given equations you have to carry out the calculations now let's first think about the series combination see value of r1 that is 100 plus or minus 3 ohm it implies that true value for the measurement of r1 that is 100 ohm and 3 that is the absolute error in the measurement of r1 similarly r2 that is Equal to 200 plus or minus 4 ohm. It implies that 200 that is the true value of R2, and this 4 that is the absolute error in the measurement of R2. Now the equations are given to you for series combination. R that is R1 plus R2 for parallel combination. Two equations are given to you. This first equation one upon R dash equal to one upon R one plus one upon R two. Using this one, you can calculate the value of the series resistance, sorry, parallel resistance, and then after using this second equation, delta R dash upon R dash square equal to delta R one upon R one square plus delta R two upon R two square. you can calculate the absolute error in this resultant of parallel combination r dash okay now clear up to this one what we are going to do now for series combination r that is r1 plus r2 so 100 plus or minus 3 value of r1 with absolute error plus 200 plus or minus 4 value of r2 with its absolute error but we studied this thing in the summation or subtraction of physical quantities the absolute errors will be sum up so here the summation is there so true value of the resultant resistance in series combination that will be 100 plus 200 that is 300 and the absolute error in the final result that is 3 plus 4 that is 7 so we can write the result that is equal to 300 plus or minus 7 ohm clear to all of you now for parallel combination so first using equation 1 upon r dash equal to 1 upon r1 plus 1 upon r2 let's calculate the true value for the resultant resistance in the parallel combination so here we can rewrite this equation as r dash equal to r1 r2 upon r1 plus r2 now substitute the true values r1 100 r2 200 upon r100 plus r22200 so your answer 
RDS that is 200 by 3 ohm or we can write that is 66.7 ohm clear up to this one now use another equation delta r dash upon r dash square equal to delta r1 upon r1 square plus delta r2 upon r2 square now take this r dash square on right hand side so we can write r dash square into delta r1 upon r1 square plus delta r2 upon r2 square equal to now substitute the values r dash that is 200 by 3 so 200 square upon 3 square into bracket delta r1 that is the absolute error in the measurement of r1 and that is given to you 3 then r1 that is the true value of r1 that is 100 so 100 square plus delta r2 upon r2 square so that is 4 by 200 square now suppose we take this 200 square and this 3 square inside the bracket then we can rewrite this one as 200 into 200 into 3 upon 3 square into 100 into 100 plus 200 square into 4 divided by 9 into 200 square so see here this 200 square 200 square directly cancelled in first step this four zeros are cancelled and one three that is cancelled so resultantly here you will get delta r dash that is equal to This two into two four by three. So first step that is four by three, plus the second step that is four by nine. And when you solve this one, your answer will be one point eight. So resultantly now you can write R dash that is equal to its true value plus or minus its absolute error. so true value that we calculated here that is 66.7 and delta r dash the absolute error we calculated 1.8 so resultantly you can write the resistance in the parallel combination that is equal to 66.7 plus or minus 1.8 ohm